Hello and welcome to 5-Minute Math. Today we are looking at the fifth grade concept of taxes. This is a part of personal financial literacy, which is standard 5.10a in the great state of Texas. We are using item number 32 off the 2018 released star test. If you have not done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and then we will look at our answers together. So we have a simple question and we are looking for something that is not. So let's make sure that we understand that. That's going to be very important. They put it in capital for us. Not an example of a property tax, which means three of these are going to be an example of a property tax. One of these is not. So we're looking for that answer. So let's define a property tax. So a property tax is, is a tax that is levied on you by actually quite a few different government sources. So you've got your, your state government. It's going to get a little chunk of that money. Your local city government, or could be your county government, depending on where you live, your local government is going to take a tax, and that is going to help with many different things, uh, like fire, police, uh, other emergency services. Uh, that's what helps pay for firefighters and all that. Also, we've got school districts. So the school district that you live in, even if you don't have kids that go to that school district, even if for some reason uh, maybe you go to a private school or you're homeschooled, you are still going to uh, get paid a property, get levied a property tax, and that is going to help pay for the salaries of teachers and the school buildings and all that. And then finally, sometimes even uh, you'll get uh, like a community college that if it's uh, like a public community college might also have some taxes there as well. So all of that comes from your property. So we have a lot of property, but when we're dealing with a property tax, typically there are two different uh, things that we're looking at here. We're looking at first just land. So let's say you own land and it could just be you have a ranch, you just have, you know, you have acres of land, maybe it's farmland or something like that. And then any houses that are valued on the land. Now, typically, if you are buying a house, those two get wrapped up together. You get just one tax and it's the value of the land plus the value of the house sitting on the land. But sometimes they're separate. So that's what we're looking for. Anything that is dealing with the land or a house, that is going to deal with your property tax. So let's see what F says. F says, the tax paid on the value of a farm. All right, well, a farm actually is a good combination of both. Uh, it definitely has land, and there typically is a house on that land, which means that is a property tax, and we don't want it. Because we're looking for, remember, the answer that is not an example of a property tax so F is incorrect. G. Tax paid on the value of a piece of land. Well, that's exactly what we just said. It could just be a piece of land. Maybe they're hunting. Maybe they own the land and they're going to buy a house and build a house on it later, but they just kind of bought it in two different chunks. We don't know. But for whatever reason, they have land just sitting by itself. It is property and it is going to be taxed with a property tax. H, tax paid on the value of a piece of furniture. Hmm, so if you are sitting at a kitchen table, you're sitting on a couch, uh, you're sitting in a chair, then you're sitting on furniture. And that does not seem to land within either of these two areas, land and house, because we have lots of different furniture. Um, and, you know, some people sit in chairs, some people just sit on a box. So that doesn't look right. So I'm thinking H is the answer because that doesn't look like property. J, the tax paid on the value of a home. There we go. There's your home. So that's property. So no, our answer here is H because that is not property. That's just something inside your house. 